Yo guys, I'm literally telling you this now. This is all planned. I think the joke is on all of us. Portia and Simon planned all of this out. There's no ways that these two lovebirds were on holiday just four days ago. Portia decided to post Simon and was talking about he's my ride or die. And, you know, was all lovey-dovey then. Four days later, she's changed her mind. I don't think that she only uh, learned about all those allegations about a day ago this is something that is planned and then all of a sudden you know she's going back to the royal housewives of atlanta it just does not make uh, any sense as we all know things are currently mm, going south um for simon and all of a sudden you know the wife the ex-wife decides to dip you guys now they have only been married for what one year and three months after having so many weddings <laughs> Um, and um, of course, uh, there's just many reasons that have been given as to why Portia has decided to file for divorce just 15 months into uh, the marriage, you guys. And um, that report, that legal report that was released is about 15 pages long. But I'll just um, give you guys some of the most important uh, things that were said or rather the reasons as to why Portia would want to file uh, for divorce from Simon. So first and foremost, it is alleged that he got denied for his U.S. citizenship after applying several times due to being a fraudster and scammer. Uh, now, um, the court papers further reveal that 30 years ago, uh, Simon overstayed his visa. Uh, they said that in 1987, he pleaded guilty for bank and credit card fraud. In 1989, he got arrested for unauthorized use of a vehicle. And in 1990, he got arrested for ID fraud. Uh, and the list is just endless, you guys. It goes on and on and on. So obviously, a lot of people are stating that, you know, chances of him getting deported deported are like 99,9999% and Portia does not want to be a part of this. Some people are saying that, you know, uh, she might be trying to cover him up. She does not uh, want to be a part of it and she just wants the money, the bag, you know, uh, secure the bag and just leave the poor guy, you guys. And... <sighs> I'm on the fence with this one. I don't know whether to feel sorry for Portia or whether to be celebrating because, you know, the way that she got this man, he was married to her friend. You understand? So I just don't know whether to be feeling sorry for her or whether to be happy. Who won in this case, you guys? Do you think that the Simon guy got married to Portia for the papers? Some people are saying it's 50-50 because Portia also wanted the money. And then, you know, Simon also wanted citizenship. So, but what are your thoughts on this one, you guys? Please, let's just engage one another down on the comments. And are you going to be watching the new season of The Real Housewives of Atlanta? please let's just engage one another down on the comments like the video and i will surely see you guys on the next one bye